Okay, well, it should be up and going now. Okay, so, welcome back, guys. Um, this is it. So, this is the 10th episode of my stream. Okay, 10th episode of my playthrough. We're going to go through, um, try to beat the Elite Four. So let's do a quick recap just for anyone who's new, hasn't seen anything yet. So we did the whole playthrough, made it through each gym. Um, caught six fighting type. There are only six fighting type in the game. Um, where are my badges at? Uh, managed to get all the gyms, beat all the gym leaders. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, there we go. Uh, beat all of them. Crushed them. Uh, beat Rourke, uh, Rock, Grass, Fighting, Water, Ghost, Steel, Ice, Electric. Okay, so we beat all those guys. I have no idea what the Elite Four has in store for us. I only know that there's a Fighting type uh, Elite Four member. That's all I remember from when I played this game before. Uh, but let's take a look at my team. Um, we have a level 74 Infernape. Level 66 Machamp, 61 Heracross, 66 Metacham, 60 Lucario, and 66 Toxicroak. Okay, so those that's our team. Um, their movesets are pretty spread out. So if we check them out here, movesets are pretty spread out. I should have something to combat most. Um, not as spread out as I'd like to be, but I guess we'll see how it goes. So yeah. I'm Amatimus, guys. Thanks for joining in. Let's uh, go through and attempt this. Oh, of course. Do I really have to fight my rifle before? Well, okay. Well, I guess we'll start there before we even uh, get to the Elite Four. We'll see. If he dummies me, then I'll know I'm not ready. If I beat him, then I know I should roughly be ready. So let's check it out here. So he starts with a Star Raptor with Intimidate, which has is a little bit of a trouble against a fighting team, right? Because most of my moves are f uh, physical based. So let's start with a Flamethrower here. See if we can beat him. Infernape does have a half decent special attack. And Focus Sash to hold up, stop the. Starts with a Rain Dance, Kate. Okay. So I'm not too worried about the Rain Dance. That's fine. Because Infernape's not going to stay in. I will, I will use a Power Up Punch here, though, to give myself that little extra bonus before we uh, move on to the next guy. Okay, let's see who he's got next. I don't know if there's anyone on his team that gave me much trouble throughout the game. Snorlax. Well, Snorlax is easy. So I'm going to put in my strongest guy, which is going to be... Well, let's give Machamp a shot here. Machamp's been pretty good. Um, as long as my rival doesn't have a... Doesn't have a Gyarados. It should be good. Uh, well, we're obviously going to use Cross Chop here. Go big or go home, right? There we go. Crushing him. That's a bad type advantage for him. And I I got the bonus of, I'm pretty sure all my Pokemon are best friends with me. So they get that friend bonus. Which is a little cheap, but hey, I'll take that. Um, Rose Raid. Okay, so Infinite comes back in. Still raining, so my fire type's going to be weakened a little bit. But I did get that power up punch in there. I'm liking how this battle's going so far. Um, let's. Do I use Flare Blitz to look like a boss? No, because I might. Need, I might need him for Nape again here. So let's go with uh, Flamethrower. Should get him. Nice. Okay, I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, and he's a lot. My rival is gonna be a lot weaker than the Elite Four, so I'm not gonna get too far ahead of myself. Especially when I don't know who the Elite Four members are. Um, I don't have any ground type. You know, let's go with Heracross against Empoleon. Because 
Steel is not going to hurt me too, too bad. And water doesn't affect bugs either, so. Let's go with that one. Um, close combat. I'm only going to use Heracross once this battle, so. Oh, hoo I really hope that Elite Four is a little bit more challenging than this. I thought uh, I thought it's going to have a tougher time for sure. I'm pretty sure all their guys are in the 60s. High 50s, low 60s. If not, then I guess I steamroll them. So, Kyrie levels up there. No more rain. Rapid Ash. So, fire guys aren't the easiest because I really don't have any... Uh, I'll use my champ again. Uh, do I want to use all my guys in this battle? Nah, I'll use my champ again. He's got that rock move that I purposely put on there to fight. He's going to be my main guy against the rock guy. Or the fire uh, elite four member. So we'll go... Well, he's faster than me. Yeah, Machamp, uh, his speed took a little bit of a hit. He ain't the fastest guy out there. But that's alright. Because we're still going to get that one hit KO. I'm liking where we're at right now. He's got one more guy. His tor oh no, he doesn't have the Torterra Heracross. See, I don't have a flying guy. Uh, no. So I guess we'll go back to uh, Infernape here. He's uh, just the last guy to battle. Then I'm going to go for it. I purposely put this move on Infernape just to use in a time like this. So here comes Flare Blitz. I'm only using Flare Blitz right now because I have the Poke Center that I can go back to. Because Flare Blitz does a ton of damage to me. Worth it to destroy. Absolutely destroy my rival. Better luck next time. My Heracross is better than his. But yeah, that's a ton of that's a ton of damage I don't want to take into the Elite Four with me, so. Yeah, you got a lot of work to do. Okay, so as long as we don't come against a type that's totally gonna demolish us, we should do fine. We'll see how it goes here. Dun dun. Okay, so let's do this again. Round two, guys. Here we go. Now we're going to face the Elite Four. Let's go see what kind of challenge lays ahead of us. Dude, I got all the gym badge. Relic, Mine City, Icicle. There we go. Okay, here we go. I've been approved. Let's see if my fighting team has what it takes to demolish this Elite Four. Oh, I got a first time chat on the thing here from Bang Strang Swang. Okay. Aaron, Pokemon League, I'm like, good to meet you. Bug Pokemon. I did not remember there being a bug Pokemon trainer in this Elite Four. Okay. Um, then I'm suited up right because I have Infernape in the front. So Infernape might just do this whole battle himself. And Infernape is my strongest guy because I played him at the front of my lineup the entire game. Um, I don't think I'm going to even get a power-up punch in here. But I don't want to waste all my flamethrowers because I feel like I might need them later in the, in the game. So I'll see if I can switch them out, put someone else in there. If I can get that secondary type advantage, I'd do that. The only guy, Machamp, would be a good one to get into this battle if I can. Um, do I want to switch? Oh, do I be risky? Yeah, why not? I'll put Toxic Croak in here. I'll give it a shot. I'm probably going to hose myself here. It's these decisions that cost me. 
by putting someone in there instead of just putting the type advantage in there. Oh, and he's got a super effect. He probably has Aerial Ace. I'm going to guess Aerial Ace. So let's go with Poison Jab here. Oh, that's the one. That's going to hurt. Yeah, not as bad as I thought it was going to. Okay. What the? Burned himself with a flame arrow? Okay. Um, let's just use Poison Jab again. Maybe I can poison him here and then I can use a. Uh, use a. Uh, Venom Shock. I definitely built his lineup to do more damage if the other guy is poisoned, so. Oh, holy, how many free. Full restore. Oh, did he use a full restore last round? Or was it a berry? He must have used a full restore. Yeah, and he's burned. Alright, let's go with the poison jab again, I guess. So they're only level 54. I was under the impression that they were going to be a lot higher leveled. There you go, it hits the critical hit. I thought it was going to be... They were going to be the low 60s. So we might roll through these first few, which is fine, because that stupid... I'm still worried about that Garchomp that Cynthia has. I don't even remember the rest of her team. I just know that she has a uh, Garchomp. So I'll try to get everyone in here so I'm not using too many of my... Uh, too many of my moves from other guys. I don't want to waste my PP. Yeah, I definitely think I'm going to try to stick the type advantage from here on out. Okay, Vespa Queen. Uh, we'll stick with... This is last guy. Uh, no, one more. So, Infernape will come in after this battle. And Vespa Queen is a super slow Pokemon, so to be slower than my Machamp is uh, is something. Because I'm pretty sure he's got a sub 100 speed. Drapion. Dark. He's not even Bug. He's Dark Poison. Okay, let's go with Infernape here. An all-normal team. All normal team. That's also probably the lamest team to f to do a battle with. Uh, let's see. Go hard or go home with Flare Blitz? Sure, why not? Watch him poison point me here. Got him. There we go, guys. That's one. One down. Four more to go. Three more to go and then the champion. Already surprised. I didn't. I 100% did not remember there being a bug. A bug trainer in this one. Okay. Let's heal everyone up here and head to the next one. And let's maybe stick to the type advantages. Because if I don't, then that's how I'm going to hoop myself. Yeah, I took some unneeded damage in that battle. So let's try not to do that again. Who do we got here next? So bug. And then... Is this a normal gym? I'm Bertha. Ground type. Ooh. Okay. I was wondering if there was going to be a ground one because we had a, a rock and a steel type gym leader. Now there's a ground. Okay. Quagsire always gives us a little bit of trouble. That's not the guy I want to see in the front of the battle to face my Infernape. 
I do I sack his defense and special defense and use that close combat right off the start? Yeah, sure, why not? Let's go with that. Oh, I didn't even beat him. Oh, I'm gonna get muddy watered so hard here. Here it comes. Oh, toxic. And I avoided it. Nice. So I got rid of my defense and special defense for nothing there. Power up punch is not going to be strong enough to beat this guy. Another one. <laughs> oh, man. This might be the battle that gives me a little bit of trouble here. So now I've, Infernape is kind of useless for the rest of the battle. He'll be one hit KO'd by any any half-decent move, which most of these guys are going to have Earthquake. So I might have to just watch, keep Infernape out if I can. Oh, another water guy. Um, Water ground, I guess, no. I can't put Lucario in. Uh, let's go with Heracross. Let's see how Heracross can handle this for a bit. So the comments here is, do his, I don't think his stats go back. I think they stick for the whole game. The comment was, when he goes back into my lineup, do his stats, don't my stats reset? I'm not 100% sure. I was under the impression they didn't. Oh, yeah, no bueno. Oh, is Bulldoze the one that every time he uses it? No, that's rollout. Oh, but he lowers my accuracy. And I'm using a move that doesn't have the most accurate. Oh, and now it's going to use... Oh, it's just my speed. Well, it's a good thing I put the Quick Claw on. Um, let's go with Throat Chop. <sighs> One of my favorite new moves, Throat Chop. There aren't that many sound-based moves that I think they need to have a move that negates the sound-based, but... Throat Chop's still pretty sweet. Holy! Like, I know I'm slow, but that Whiz Cash is fast. Oh, 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 come on. Am I going to lose my first guy here? Go on, use that quick claw. Come on. Is that it? Oh, three. <laughs> Still haven't lost a guy. That was way closer than I thought it was going to be. But now I sacked his defense too. Okay, okay. Sudowoodoo is a rock type, not a ground type. So any of my guys should do fine against him. Let's get Metacham out there for a little bit. Yeah, see, this is why I didn't think there would be a ground type, because most of the rock Pokemon in this game were used in the gyms for the steel and rock type. Now she's using you know, just a straight rock type against my, against me instead of an actual, but he has sturdy. Oh, no sturdy on this one. Okay, that works. I was totally prepping for a sturdy on that one. Okay, that works. Get rid of her rock type, even though she's a ground type trainer, whatevs. No judgment. When I say I'm a fighting type, I'm only using fighting types, so. Oh, let Metacham fight this one out. Oh, Low Kick does more damage the heavier they are. And Gollum is a heavy Pokemon. But he has Sturdy. Okay. So if I can... Oh, I'll use Rock Polish. Well, that's alright, because I'll still use... She's going to waste all her... Her... Uh, full Restores here. Because she's going to Full Restore him. So if I can only do a little bit of damage, then I can get rid of that uh, Sturdy and not get stuck with her full restoring eight times this battle. So you Shadow Ball, do a little bit of damage here. Lower his speed. There's special defense. And now, well, 
Guess I'm not using a special attack. Whoa! Where did that speed come from? I don't remember Gollum being the fastest Pokemon in the world. I didn't think my uh, Medicham was that slow. One more guy. Can Medicham do it? Um, now nah, let's let my champ go out here. Oh, I thought Rock Polish just upped his defense. Oh, a female. Okay, let's go with Cross Chop, see how we do here. Ooh, that did not do nearly as much as I thought it was going to do. Don't want to use... Oh, low kick. I have low kick. He's going to be a heavy guy. This should kill him. Yep. There we go. I knew I kept low kick for a reason on some of these guys. Nice. And I had to keep Lucario out of that battle because I knew he wasn't going to do... And I'll have to keep Lucario out of the fire guy, too. There we go, guys. Two down. Whew. I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, so far, so good. I'm not getting totally owned, but I'm still... I don't feel totally comfortable going into this, into some of these battles here. Alright, so i got to use a Max Potion on Heracross. A couple Hyper Potions here. Okay, and I'm not going to save. I'm going to do the entire Elite Four without saving so that if I lose, I have to face the shame of losing. I think this is the fire guy next. Yeah. Okay, so the fire guy is going to be my champ's domain. Okay, let's go. Round three. Yeah, that's the guy we met earlier in the game here. Feeling pretty confident. I'm still a little worried. Some of these battles are... I think it's just my nerves, maybe. Okay, so Rapidash versus Infernape to start. Let's use Power Up Punch a couple times here. And like kind of jack my Infernape up a little bit here. I'll praise him for that critical hit. And pump my own attack up. Flame charge. Is that the one that hits with no recoil on flame charge? That's the one I want for Infernape. Flare Blitz is okay, but... Poison Jab? Come on. No poison, no poison, no poison. Nice. There we go. And I got that two... Here we go, here we go. Lopany. Oh, that's a normal type. So they most of them have an extra guy in there that's not part of their type. Well, I'll just power up punch him again and just really jack my uh Infernape up. I'm gonna beat the fire guy with my fire guy here. I know Steelix can learn fire moves, but not really a fire Pokemon. Um, Flare Blitz is physical, right? Yeah, I might as well go go all out here. I'll switch Infernape out. We'll get some other guys in here for this battle. There's a reason I kept Power Up Punch. It's one of the first moves that Chimchar learns. But I've kept it for this exact reason. So some of these tough battles where I can get... Oh, he's not even close to a... But he's a ghost type. So now I'm going to put Heracross in here. This is why I have Throat Chop. But 
I guarantee this guy's gonna have aftermath. And he's gonna be up faster than my Heracross. Lower my speed even more. Oh, attack. Yeah, that hurt. Okay, okay. And healed. So it's gonna take me at least two more hits. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. And he's sapping my strength every time. Ay, no bueno. Oh, and it heals him? Yeah, I'm not going to be doing much damage, especially if he keeps using. Oh, it doesn't do damage to me. It just takes my, uh, my attack. And now I can't hit him. I might have, uh, come on. There we go. Oh, too much damage. Now he's going to full heal here. <sighs> Minimize again. Okay, okay. I see how this is going to be. Oh, we didn't use a full restore? <sighs> oh, nice. See? Best friends. Me and Heracross. We're like this. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, and there's the full restore. Oh, I wish I could have got that hit before. I'm wasting too many of my throat chops. I Nice. He must have Hex. That's why he's trying to use Wisp, Will-O-Wisp on me. Hex Will O Wisp. Oh, it doesn't. Why would he have Will O Wisp and Baton? Oh, who is he sending out? His Infernape. I didn't know he had an Infernape. That's a bad type matchup against my Heracross, who has literally been sapped of all his strength. Oh, I'll go for Broke here. That's gonna hurt. Yep. Oh. I don't want to sack Heracross, but I'm going to have to. Hopefully he gets the... No. Oh, nice. Come on. Hit, hit, hit. It's not doing as much damage as I would like. This Infernape actually might become a problem. I'm going to have to send out Metachamp. Oh, Heracross is losing his moves like crazy. Okay, that's all right. We made it three battles in before we lost our first guy. And I trust, I think Machamp can handle this. This Infernape's strong, but he can't be Rock Slide strong. Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. Took care of him. I, was a, I wasn't, I'm not going to say I was worried on that one. Because I have five guys still. But he's definitely a lot tougher than I thought he was going to be. Oh, a stupid drift blim out here again. Um, can't use him. Uh, let's try Infernape. Oh, I should have just kept uh, Machamp out there. Because he's a flying type. That's alright. I'll be able to use... Uh, I should be able to hit him with a flamethrower. <laughs> he's blazing now. Oh, you are. Cause you're going down a heap of fire and watch him hit me with an aftermath here oh it didn't even get me nice okay there we go three down i lost one guy but we'll revive him here still not stressing totally 
somewhat, kind of a little bit. All right, let's heal some guys here. Oh my god, no, I'm not gonna use the max revive. I'll save that for if I ever have to use a. Use a revive in battle. Okay, so Heracross, I just want to quickly check. Heracross used a lot of his moves in that battle. Yeah, only two close combats left. Everyone else is good. Okay. Okay, who is... What is the last type we fight here in the Elite Four? Okay, stand in the middle of a spot. Last member in the Elite Four is... A psychic? It is a psychic. We are going to be... Oh, please don't be psychic. Oh, I have a feeling it's psychic. Oh, no. This is what I didn't want to fight in the Elite Four was a psychic guy. Oh, this has a chance of dummying my team. Okay. So this one, I actually, I have to play this one smart. I'm going to have to use Metacham. So a Psychic Fairy to start. I'm really going to have to play this one smart. <laughs> okay. Guess we just see can Flamethrower carry me through this one. I gotta try to just grind out as many as I can with Infernape here. No. Physical attacks. Okay, so they put a barrier up against physical attacks. Which is fine because I. Tr My. Metatem also knows. I think he knows Shadow Ball. Which is good. Okay. Alakazam. V. I don't want to put. Hair cross. He's just so slow. No, let's go with Medicha. No, hair cross. He's got the bug typing, so that it shouldn't be affected too too much by the psychic. So hair, but and then he has Mega Horn and. Throat chop. What is the accuracy? 80, 85, 120, 80. Okay, we'll try throat chop. Oh, so he protected himself here. Okay, okay. Um, I should have used Mega Horn. Let's see how much damage this does. Oh! Oh, see. Oh, he saved himself because he didn't want to make me feel sad. Oh, no. See, this is what I'm worried about. These psychic guys are so powerful against me. I've only beaten two of them. Okay, I'm going to use Metacham. I'm pretty sure Draft Rig is just normal with psychic moves, or is he psychic? No, he's. Uh oh. Yeah, he is. He's normal psychic. That's why I can't use Shadow Ball against him. Oh, that's a bad one. Let's see what I got here. Oh, I just got the score update. The Leafs beat the Oilers again. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, back to this. Before my guy gets destroyed. Ah. Yep. Okay. Held on so I wouldn't feel sad. Get the drain punch in there. Heal yourself a little bit. I really 
really didn't want to lose him this early. Three, two guys left after this. If he can hold on here and not die on the psychic. No, no way. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to put Infernape back out. Finish off the draft rig here. And see if Heracross, if I need to use Heracross for the next few. So let's go Flamethrower. Holy, how fast is this guy? Ay, yeah, no bueno. I, I was so worried about a Psychic guy in this Elite Four. Because I knew this, was, this would be tough. I'm actually, like, stressing a little bit here. Okay, so psychic fighting. Okay, we'll keep him out here. And we'll flare blitz him! Holy! These guys are all so fast. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay. Who do I got? Heracross only has one health. Uh oh. Okay, I'm not feeling so hot now. I should have just kept. Oh, that's right. I knew he had something. Okay, so I need I need poison jab to poison him here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, poison him. Yes, yes. No, no. Oh no way! This guy is dummying my team, and he's gonna full heal here, so I can put. Oh no. Oh. Oh uh oh. Okay, now I'm not feeling so confident here. I'm going to have to use a max revive. Oh, shoot. This Metacham is messing me up. I use a max potion on Heracross or bring Infernape back because he's fast. I'm going to use that on Infernape. Uh oh. Oh, this is why I didn't want to fight a psychic guy. Nothing super effective. So I gotta. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna have to sack the champ here to heal hair across. Man, that Zen headbutt. Oh no, 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 no! Okay. Who's my fastest guy here? I gotta go. I gotta use Flare Blitz here. Come on, come on. I need this. Yeah! Yeah! Oh. Oh, okay, who do you got left? Who's gonna crush me here? No way. This is way too stressful. Okay, well, Bronzong, he'll have, he could have Sturdy. But I have a type advantage on him because he's Steel. Okay. Holy cow. This is way more stressful than it should be. There's no way he's faster than me, though, so... I do have that bonus. Oh my goodness! 
Oh, thank goodness you didn't have sturdy. Oh my goodness, that was the most stressful battle. Oh my goodness. I was so worried about there being a psychic guy. Holy. Oh, I need a drink of water after that one. That was too intense. Give me a second here. I'm like shaking after that one. That one was too, uh, wait, even with my over-leveled guys, that was too hard. Holy cow, he decimated my team there. I just wasn't ready for that Metacham. That Metacham totally just went to town on my guys. And now I'm worried that her guard chomp is going to do the same. Okay, let's I don't... Who's my fastest guy? Is 157. So these are my two fastest game. Okay. I'll remember that. She has a Spirit Tomb. She has a Guard Chomp. Which I really don't have anything to beat the Guard Chomp. Oh, uh, actually, does Lucario? I think Lucario has a Dragon move. No, I got rid of it. Yeah, I really have nothing to face the. Guard Chomp. I'm just literally gonna have to out muscle the Guard Chomp, which sucks. I don't know how I'm gonna do that. Okay, give me one second. I gotta check my. Do I give someone Dragon Pulse? Where is it? Do I give Lucario Dragon Pulse? What do you guys think? Give. Give Lucario Dragon Pulse. Let's see. What would I replace it with? Do it. Get rid of... I don't know if I'm going to give myself enough time to even use Sword Dance. But maybe it would actually be half decent to do it. Special attack's pretty high. I feel like I need to give him. Get rid of close combat. Oh, I don't really want to get rid of Aura Sphere. Okay, we'll do that. Okay, let's, uh, let's do that. Just because I'm freaked out about this. This last battle has me too freaked out. Okay. Do I save? Just so I save you guys from having to watch me do this all over again? I said I didn't want to save because I didn't want to. I mean, I, st I still get the... Okay, I've been told not to save. Okay, no saving. <sighs> oh, no. I'm actually nervous about this battle here. Okay. Yeah, I'm already strapped. I'm having a heart attack here. Oh, I accept your challenge. <sighs> okay, let's go. I'm literally going to try to keep Infernape in as long as I can. Unless I have an absolute type advantage. So Spirit Tomb, just a ghost type. I think just a ghost type. <laughs> yeah, let's go with flamethrower off the start here. It's 
shouldn't kill them. That's, oh, come on with the berries. All the time with the berries. But what I think I can do now... Oh, no. That's going to hurt. I think I can flare blitz them. I think I can flare blitz them. I'm going to sack my own HP here, though. Yep. Come on. Okay. Got rid of the spirit tomb. I really... Oh, that's... That's a lot of damage for him to take right off the start. Ground water. No, I don't want to use him. Do I, can I beat him with him? Slow, but gas run on slope two. Oh, I should be able to low kick him. Okay, let's go here. It's a fighting team. So one of my comments is where all my status moves. It's a fighting team. It's all physical. Okay, low kick should do a good chunk of damage here, though. Because he is a heavy ground. Oh, come on! No way! Okay, well, he didn't do much damage back. and just lowered my speed. Oh, I need leftovers. Okay. How much damage is cross drop? 100? Let's go with cross drop. Oh, I withdrew. Uh oh. Rose raid. Oh, he'll poison me here. See if fairy he might have a fairy move. Let's try rock slide and see if I can. I knew he was gonna have jazz and gleam. Get him. Yeah! Yeah! Got him. So, he's got two guys down. But I've taken a lot of damage on two of my guys. Oh, and a water type. Let's go with Toxicroak here. Let's see if Toxicroak can poison him and then... Ooh, my heart's pumping here. 63. Oh, yes. Because he's still just a water type, right? No, poison jab. So I'm faster. Come on, poison him. Come on, poison him. Poison him, poison him. Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Scald, that's fine. I can handle Scald. Hola. So now I have a 120 power Venal Shock. 130 power Venal Shock. Get out! No! No way! No. Oh, he oh. That was a lot of damage for Poison to do. Oh, my team is getting obliterated. I don't want to put these guys out yet. Water ground. Oh, I gotta hope Metacham can do something here. No way, come on. This is actually, this battle is a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be. So I'm happy that I jumped my... Oh, 
Hopefully no damage. He's gonna burn me here. This gas run on is killing me. I needed a grass move bad. And I had grass knot. I had guys that could learn grass knot. Let's go with drain punch. Heal myself here. I just got to get him as low as I can and then hope that uh, one of my other guys can get him. Oh, this is stressing me out here. Okay, okay, what do we got here? So I don't mind him using Rock Tomb. He can use Rock Tomb all he wants. I'm still going to be faster than him. Should be faster than him. Oh, that freaking... There she, her whole team is weakening me out so much that I'm going to have a hard time beating this. This, uh, Garchomp. I actually am a little stressed about this, where this battle is going to go. <sighs> Should I sack Metacham and heal my guys up? She's going to use a, a max revive here. So what I'm going to do is after this one, if it doesn't get back into the yellow, then she'll heal him. No, she's going to heal him. So I'm going to heal my guy. I'm going to heal my Infernape. Yeah. Infernape, yeah. Oh, okay. Gives me a second chance here. I might actually be able to beat his gastrid on here. Maybe. We'll see. Probably not. It's probably going to be too. But I did heal. Uh, Still fast, right? They're like this Gastron can use these attacks these all game, but now is she going to heal? Do I heal? Is that Garchomp gonna be? Is gonna be faster than my Machamp? Is he going to be stronger that I can't get at least one attack out with Machamp? Do I heal Machamp here? Yeah. Mm. And still no... Still no... Uh... I might be able to get him here with uh, one more heal drain punch. Oh, he's finally faster than me. Okay, that's fine though, because he'll heal up here. I can put uh, a champ out to finish it with a cross chop. Will it finish it? I don't want to put Infernape out there. Can't put him because he has a rock. So it's got to be Machamp. My Machamp should still be faster than him. Okay, cross chop. Don't let me down here. No! Oh! oh, I threw my controller. No! <laughs> Stupid. 
Okay. Hit him this time, please. Yes. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna get infinite about here. Try to use power up punch at least once. What can Lucario have that would hurt me? He shouldn't hurt me too, too bad. But I do need to use a power up punch here. It's super effective, so maybe I'll use two power up punches if I do enough damage here. Oh, yeah, for sure. That'll pump me up for the Garchomp. <laughs> Aura Sphere, Sphere. Oh! Come on! Okay, well, one more power up punch. So I have my full team. So Garchomp has to beat six of my guys. I'm going to keep Infernape in. See if I can get one move in. And then I will heal him with... This is what I've been waiting for. This is the, this is the one Pokemon... That I've been ready thinking about fighting this whole game. <sighs> it's gonna be fast. He's gonna be faster than me here. Oh, earthquake off the start. Mad earthquake is gonna rock my team. Shoot. How heavy is Garchomp? Do I waste a do I waste a thing on to see if Low Kick does any damage to him? Oh, sword dance shit. Okay, so I gotta hope that this did a ton of damage to him, because that's not what I needed. Come on, please, 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 please. Not horrible. If I can get one more of those in, then I think I can get Come on, no whammy. Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so I sacked him. So I just need to get one attack out. One attack out. Talks, talk, he's not going to be faster. But you know what I'll do is I will heal Infernape. Cause he's gonna dummy that that uh Do I have max revive? Did he beat Infernape in one move? Three guys. Oh Who did I use it on? No, I wasted it. No. Stupid. That just cost me the whole thing. That might have cost me. Why would it not say unaffected? Why would it do that? Well, I gotta use close combat here. I'm choked right now. Come on. That totally grinds my gears.
he's gonna be faster than me. He's gonna use. I don't think I can kill him with a dragon pulse here. I gotta hope that Lucario holds on through an earthquake here. Don't kill me. That's it. That guard chomp dummied my entire team. Oh. That's so frustrating. I'm absolutely choked right now. I should add one more Pokemon to battle with. No way. That's that's literally the first time I've lost this entire game. That hurt so bad. I don't even think I am much better through that battle. The only other thing I can think is to get rid of that. Uh... <sighs> I gotta do the whole thing over again. Oh, I gotta teach him Grass Knots. Shadow Ball is useless. I didn't do anything with Shadow Ball, so. Oh, Lee. Well, that was probably the most depressing thing I've ever. That was bad. I was so close. I was right there. I knew that Guard Chomp was going to be strong, but that strong. I had six guys before. I was only down. I wasn't down anyone. Was I down? I might have been down Medicham. I did. I absolutely. One of the comments, I remember saying my team was overleveled. It was overleveled. That's harsh. That one sucks. Go shopping now that I know my... I, there, I did. I buy all the TMs anyways. Oh... I need someone else to know where are my TMs. Where is Dragon? Did I use my only Dragon Pulse too? Probably. No one else can learn it. I need an Ice move. I needed a. Oh, <laughs> I'm so flustered. I don't even know what to do. I don't know if I should go try again, or I don't want to put you guys through that. Who wants to see me try one more time? I know it, that was a long stretch of time before I even got there. I'll give the consensus here to the to the page. Hit it again. Do I have anything different? That's... <laughs> I wouldn't mind you seeing me do it again. You want to see me lose again? Oh, that's so frustrating. I just... So who did he start with? Spirit Tomb. So I guess I would change it up for the first time in this entire game. Okay, let's do it again. Let's not. We're not going in blind this time, so I have a little bit of an advantage. I will save now after that depressing loss. Oh, <laughs> I'm just demoralized right now. Okay. <sighs> Let's try this one more time. And I'm not going to be switching people out. I'm just going to, if I have the type advantage with Infernape, especially with this first guy, I'm just going to go through it. <laughs> I can't believe I lost that one. Oh. That's frustrating. Okay. Let's try this one more time here. Just give me one quick second here. Uh, 
Just checking my Wi-Fi signal here for you guys. Okay, let's do this battle. Oh, I don't... How am I going to beat that Garchomp? He's so fast. He's so fast. He can make fast people look not so fast. Okay, no no more messing around. I'm just going to play serious this one. That stupid... That psychic guy is going to give me trouble again. Flamethrower through this whole team. I'm not even going to think twice about this guy's team. Just going to go through the whole thing. And then that ground guy, I'm just going to power up punch my entire, my entire team through him. Flamethrower, get out of my face, Heracross. Oh, that hurt. I can't believe that. That Garchomp is too too good. I didn't actually think I was going to lose to that Garchomp. That's such a... Uh... Oh, that's frustrating. <laughs> Let's try it again here. This time, if I make it to the... To the finals, I'm. I don't want to. I want to say just because I don't want to have to do the elite four all over again. But if you guys are all gonna call me cowards, then. <sighs> oh. Okay. Let's just rip through these guys. I kind of want to save some of these flamethrowers, but I guess not. And I I was like flying high after the first battle. I'm like, oh, this bug guy crushed him. It was easy. It didn't even, didn't even bother me. Well, watch this earthquake. Come on. These flare blitz on this one. <laughs> oh, I'm so frustrated. Oh, come on with the not dying there. A second. Well, it just makes me realize that this game, like. I know once I beat the Elite Four, if I ever do, that the gym leaders all pump up their Pokemon after this. So once we're done the Elite Four, I do want to do a playthrough where I tackle the, the repeat of the each gym. But I'm not uh, super convinced that I'm going to just roll through those guys. Next one. Let's see what we got here. I think I was well. No, I I got I got stomped by. Uh, by actually, let's keep Infernape out and let's see if I can just power up punch my way through this entire team. Okay, walk up to her like a human being. It's stupid controls for this game. I wonder if these guys know that this is like a formality to me. Like fighting these guys, the first two or three. Oh, I forgot he started with a quag. Sorry, I should have started with that. Uh... Well, I'll just power up punch my way through this. 
He's gonna use muddy water or surf or something on me here or hydro pump. Or toxic can poison me. Oh, and I healed myself from the poison. Nice. I just keep pumping myself up here. Earthquake. That's such a strong move. It really is. Wonder if Medicham can learn Blizzard. She's going to heal again here. Full restore. While the poison festers in my body. Yeah. Oh, nice. I don't think my attacks are going to go much higher this battle, so. <sighs> what a frustrating turn of events. I just need, yeah, I, I needed to be faster. My guys weren't fast enough. Okay, now I'll put Metacham in with that Grass Knot. I think that stops one hit KOs. Which this one pro That's it. Four times effective. And it's going to do that much damage you gotta be joking me it's not like he's a light Pokemon either he's a ground type badge boost gets Oh. Yeah, I don't know how effective that uh, grass on is going to be against that grass that gas root on if it barely did any damage to uh, Wiz Cash. Um, Sudowoodo is a rock type. Oh, I can just keep Metacham out here. Barry is that he didn't have that last time. Oh, he's gonna knock himself out here. Didn't double edge didn't double edge do recoil damage? Oh <laughs> I was still not over it. Steel move, knock me out. That's fine. I do have no. These aren't the battles I'm worried about. It's just that last one, with that. Come on with the earthquakes. Maybe I should be using earthquake. If I have anyone that can even learn it, come on. I 
Last time I would have been saying this entire playthrough that Sturdy might be my least favorite but also favorite ability. Ooh, and that golem's quick too. Grass Knot is weight based, but he's still a ground type. Lots of most ground types are heavier. Ooh, I better watch myself. I'm not doing super great against this guy. I already lost two people. Ice Fang. Come on. Well, he definitely ain't gonna be faster than Infernape using close combat, so. Yeah. Beating you was a foregone conclusion. Okay, two down, two to go. Before I can go and cry myself to sleep when I lose again to that guard chomp. That steel type on, on, uh... oh, I should probably heal myself before I start this battle. That steel type on Lucario makes it so hard to get him in there to use, actually use a uh, Dragon Pulse. Oh, I can't believe it. Let me actually waste a turn to use that max, try to use that max revive on. If I do recall, Infernape kind of rolled through these guys last turn. charge yeah that's a sick move and raises speed Did you just use sing, sing on me Okay, I'm totally shook. My nerves are shot. Well, Heracross pushing 200 there. Yeah, I'm kind of running out of power up punch here too. I mean, at least my guys are all leveling up here, right? So, they're not going to be totally the same level by the time they face these guys next time. Face that Garchomp again. It's just that Garchomp. That's it. That Garchomp literally rolled my team. I 
couldn't tell you the last time I lost an Elite Four challenge. Uh, Rock Slide will crush this guy too. Ow. Yeah, seriously, two in one day. It's about to be. Okay, this Drift Blim should be able to beat him here. I feel like I'm not talking nearly as much as I was the first time. I come in here all talking, big game, and then just gets dummied by Garchomp and barely says anything now. It's gonna burn me here. But I should knock him out with this Rock Slide. Yeah. Goodbye. See you later. Also, La Vista. Does this guy have want two fire types in his entire team? So much for being a fire type. Okay, who did this psychic person start with last time? Who did she start with? Anyone remember? I don't remember. I just remember her Metatown gave me a ton of trouble. So I need to get Heracross out there quick. Against the Metacham. Okay. Did I heal everyone? Yeah. Okay, well, let's watch me stress about this battle now. So done the first three, last Elite Four member, and then on to uh, Cynthia again. Take the critical hit. Still gonna use psychic or something against me here. Oh, get him! Get him with the burn. See that one hurts because he's now all my physical types attacks do. So now I gotta stick to the. Oh, you know what I could do is just send out Heracross next. Use Brick Break to break the Reflect. Okay, there we go. Mr. Mime's done. Except I'm depleting my Flamethrower. Okay, let's go here. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Protected himself. Oh, never mind. What's the move that protects? Oh, I don't remember. Okay. So 
So all these guys are getting stronger, but they're just still so much slower than that. Than that, uh, Garchomp. Okay, Megahorn's still super effective here, so let's go with this. I mean, I would have liked to beat him there. Oh, I need to use Brick Break, that's why. So you slowed it down now, so slower Pokemon are faster. Nice. Could have used a few more of those in that final battle. Nice. Good job, Heracross. <laughs> oh! That's what Future Sight does. Now I remember. Hits me from the grave when I'm not looking. Okay, let's go with Infernape to fight the Metacham. Do I just Flare Blitz him here to hope I uh, knock him out in one try? Yeah, why not? Go hard or go home, right? Oh, he's going to get the Zen Headbutt first. No way! Come on! Okay. Poison jab. Oh, he's just gonna use trick room and now he gets... Since his guy's slower... Really use trick room wearing off right now. This Medicham's dummy in me. Oh, so now fast guys are. Faster guys attack first again. to heal uh, Infernape I will but Bronzong not overly worried about if I can live one attack here Trick room. Oh no, that's gonna hurt. Killed me. I'm gonna lose this battle. Are you kidding me? No way I'm losing this battle. Well, yeah, I know Dosh, he's stronger. Have you seen the rest of you guys? Okay, 
Um, I need to heal everyone. Okay, we'll give this one more try here. Started with Spirit Tomb, so I'm going to start with Heracross. Come on, you stupid thing. Okay, so no save. We'll go up. We'll give this another round here. Put hair across in front. Do I want to throw some berries on to stop the one hits? Increase my speed. I have no berries that will do me any good. Okay. Here we go. Round two of this embarrassing battle. Oh, I'm embarrassed that I lost in front of you guys. I feel bad. Well, let's give this a go again. Okay, so starts off with a ghost type. I'll use throat chop. Her six against my six. She good. She's pretty good. Oh, come on. As if it doesn't it only does that much damage. Holy! A. What a start to this battle! Not where I want it to be. I gotta just go with Infernape and hope that Infernape can overpower him here. That's psychic! Right off the start! And a full restore. It should be able to beat him here with one more flamethrower. Oh, that spirit tomb already started off with not where I wanted to be. No hair across for the rest of the battle. Okay, so Medicham in to fight with his new move. You know what? He didn't have. I'm gonna max revive Heracross. Oh, or full restore. No, nope, I'm gonna restore. Restore Infernape. Because if he's just gonna use uh, Rock Tomb or Scald. That's quicker than last time. Still not faster than me. 
Isn't Spirit Tomb just Ghost, or is he Ghost Dark? <sighs> Did this last time too, didn't he? Switch Gastrod on out halfway through. Yeah, and I get a weak, uh, weak move here. Come on. Uh, at least I max revived Infernape. So he can come out here and use Flamethrower. But then I lose Gastrodon against... I lose... Med oh! No! Come on! Use the right move. That's on me. That's my fault. Oh, and I got no flamethrower left either. Cool. So now I gotta get... I gotta heal... People. Tomb is not gonna hurt. Scald. Okay, because I need to heal. I need to heal people, so I'm gonna have to probably sack Toxicroak here to bring people back to life and heal people. And then I'm just gonna go all out against. Uh, All out against the uh, Garchomp. Did I use my max revives? Yeah, I'm gonna have to. That's right, keep using Rock Tomb. I don't mind. You got a long way to go before you're faster than uh, Toxic Croak. Okay, so my team is all healed up. Let's see if Toxicroak can... Oh, let's do some Drain Punch here. Still stronger, and I can heal myself up a bit here. Okay, so... Even if he uses... Oh, nice. Even if he uses Scald... I'm pretty sure he has Earthquake in there somewhere. But I feel like he would have used it if he had it. Heals with leftovers. Can I beat him here? Okay, come on. Let's go. Let's get to... Oh, ouch! I hit that lever on my chair. That hurt just a little bit. She can use a full restore. I actually I want her to use a full restore. That way she doesn't have any left on her on her uh Guard chomp. Let's see if I can poison her here, though. Let's use a couple. Which ones? Uh, I'll use a couple more. Just some poison jabs. See if I can get a poison on here. 
Nope. That's right, keep using Rock Tomb, because my guy's fast enough. Finally, I knew he had Earthquake in there. And now all he's going to use is Earthquake. Okay. Okay. That's alright, because I was able to heal my entire team while she wasted turns with that Gastrid on. So I can put Medicham back out, use those Grass Knots. I'm going to start with Lucario in that uh, battle against Garchomp. Before he has a chance to use Sword Dance or something like that. Because once he uses Sword Dance, it's over. Then he's powerful enough to one-hit KO all my guys. Milotic gave me troubles last time too. Well, I have the Grass Knot, so... Yeah, for being super effective, they're not doing as much damage as I wish they were. Interesting. Interesting. Alright, so he's burned. Don't want to use him. Guess we'll use Machamp and see if we can cross chop him to death here. Come on, Machamp. Come on, my champ. Scald is doing way more damage than it should be. Oh, well, that's a critical hit. But still, throughout the rest of the battle, it's been doing a ton of damage. Don't put him in the red. Oh. Nice. Get him here. Okay, Garchomp time. Four guys left. I'm going to start with Lucario. Oh, he still has Lucario left. Okay, I'm going to put... Oh, I don't have any flamethrowers. Steel. I'm going to have to use Flare Blitz. Okay, second last guy here. Flare Blitz should be... Lower my health? Oh, do I just use Power of Punch to get to him? That way my guy's a little bit more jacked up by the time I get to uh, Garchomp. Yeah, two Power of Punches, maybe three. And then I'll go all out with a close combat against uh, Garchomp. Yeah, there. use your full restores. I don't mind. Oh, I didn't really want the critical hit there, but... Oh, I guess that wasn't, right? Okay. <sighs> Last one. Here we go. Keep on battling. So my physical attacks do... I've upped my attack quite a bit here. 
long as he doesn't use Earthquake first. Cool. <sighs> what a rip. Okay, Lucario, let's go. No. Just tanks my team. What is happening here? Who has a chance? Who has even a chance? Infernape, I guess. I gotta get Infernape back out there. Oh. I wish my friendship benefits were coming in now. Okay. Oh, and I used all my max revives. Didn't I? Do I have... Nope. Okay, I got two guys to beat Garchomp with. And there's Sword Dance. Come on, Machamp. Come on, Machamp. Come on, it's all down to you, baby. Come on, give me a critical hit here. Give me a critical hit. Come on, save yourself. Save yourself. Hold on. No! It's gonna happen again! Okay, I gotta hope Heracross can tank one and does a critical hit here. 120. Yeah, I gotta go for close combat. Dra oh, come on. She damaged me twice. Twice in one playthrough. That is heartbreaking. Well, apparently I'm not even close to beating her. So. <laughs> oh, man. Well, that's depressing. Um, well, instead of forcing you guys to watch through a third try of that, because uh, I'm obviously, I need to go change up my movesets. I need to literally train, retrain two guys to literally be dragon killers. So, uh, I'm literally going to give every one of my guys Ice Punch. But, but to get Ice Punch, I have to you get a bunch of heart scales and I think only one guy has the ability to use the heart scale or use what I'm trying to say is one, only one of my guys has the has an ice move in his relearn abilities <sighs> well that's depressing two losses in a row that sucks Okay, well, uh, as depressing as that is, guys, that's where we're unfortunately going to have to end it tonight. Um, I need to do some more training. I really wanted to finish up on episode 10 um, and beat the game, but I guess that's not, I'm not doing it again. That's too much. Too much in one go when it's just going to turn out the same. I need to change my moves, and I don't have the stuff to beat them. So, um... Thanks for tuning in, guys. Uh, I appreciate you coming to watch me lose twice to uh, to Cynthia and her guard chomp. <laughs> as embarrassing as that is. Um, yeah, what we'll do is uh, make sure you guys check me out on Monday nights. That's the night I'm going to be streaming for sure every Monday, 7 o'clock-ish. Um, if I stream throughout the week, it'll be Tuesdays and Thursday nights if i get the chance so if you like what you guys saw uh yeah feel free to follow subscribe um if you like what you want to see a little bit more of the background stuff check me out on mcmadness underscore live on instagram and then the youtube page has the full videos of all of the streams so that's where we're at guys 
Thanks for tuning in. Sorry I couldn't uh, beat the Elite Four for you guys, but I appreciate the support. Hopefully you guys tune in next time. See you guys later.